Okay, so today's question is, which is the commonest site of central line insertion? So, we all know that we have three insertion sites. One is the internal jugular vein, the subclavian vein and the femoral one. So, the insertion in a particular vein depends upon mainly three factors, I would say. One is the accessibility, which is more accessible. Second is the compressibility, which vein is compressible because we, if the patient has coagulation disorder, or if, we, if the patient bleeds, where we can compress, whether it's, we can compress or not. And third is the post-insertion complication, which are usually the infection and the thrombus formation. So when we combined all three, so in the real case scenario, internal jugular vein is the preferred uh, site for short-term insertion. Why? Because it's easy to localize even by the ultrasound, it is very easy to localize. Secondly, the right IJV, I'm saying, although left IJV is also the same, but right IJV is preferred. It is more easily accessible. Insertion is easy. Uh, the uh, it is a little bit compressible also. And the chance of infection and thrombosis are low or moderate sort of thing. If you take care, they uh, run good. Now, the second is subclavian. Subclavian uh, vein is usually preferred if we want to keep the line for a longer period of time because the infection uh, rate is very, very low in subclavian uh, vein. But the chances of pneumothorax is a little bit high in uh, subclavian vein. Third, accessibility is also a problem because it runs below the clavicle, so at times accessibility is a problem. And most important, it is not compressible. So if we uh, the patient bleeds, then you don't have any uh, option to compress it. So this, this becomes a challenge. But for keeping the vein uh, central line for long term, subclavian is preferred. Now in emergency condition, if the, we don't know the coagulation, if it's a trauma or emergency, then femoral line is preferred for the short term, very short term. So you get an assess to the femoral line. Uh, if it bleeds also, you can compress, easy to take. But the problem is high chances of infection and high chances of deep vein thrombosis are there. So combining all these three, the commonest site for insertion is right internal jugular followed by subclavian vein and in emergency, you can take the femoral vein. So this is the order in which we uh, take short term uh, lines, internal jugular vein, long term uh, subclavian and emergency, you can take femoral. So I hope this clarifies. Do read more about it.